Hello everyone, this is Ridiculous Mad Dancer and this is my list of Clock Terror 3 Part 11 and we are in B2. So we need to get some rubber gloves because I guess the power, the cords, the electrical cords have been cut. So yeah, and we need this crowbar as well for uh, this metal grate or whatever that needs to be taken off. We'll get to that soon enough, but yeah, um, Chopper just tried to, you know, scare us and all, but I'm just like, uh, whatever. Oh, nice trick. Uh. Ugh. Well, that wasn't very smart of you. Oh my goodness, just look at his butt. <laughs> I'm sorry, but, uh, is there like a nail attached to your head to keep that cape on there? That's a little bit extreme, don't you think? Uh, I guess you're not the brightest fellow in the world, so, uh, uh, I guess we'll just ignore that and uh, I don't know it's just such a humorous thing kind of like they just keep getting Connie's silly little traps oh and uh, before we we know it's not this one it's the next one we'll go to B1 and I believe that's where we'll get an item when we go to our left, when we come out of the elevator. Come on, Lisa. Let's get out of here. The safe elevator is not the place you want to be then the whole time. We have to get things done. But we got an invisibility band. And we don't really want to go right yet because we can't do anything yet with that particular area. So let's just get our rubber gloves and oh my goodness, he, th he th already threw that that uh, axe or whatever it is, and we're probably gonna get hit. Uh, I guess uh, I guess not because it just disappeared. Get away. All right then, uh, we don't even need to go further because uh, yeah. it's. Well, not, well, you'll see it later. We need to go downstairs. Or. Yeah. Right? I guess that's going. Yeah, we're going down. We're not really downstairs, but we're going down. And we're gonna use that crowbar. Crowbar? What? <laughs> crowbar on the little middle. Uh, great. It's not even that great. It's. You'll see. I can't talk today. You'll have to excuse me and my derpiness. You can't get away. Okay, you keep saying that like, you know, you, you, I don't know. Maybe you actually believe, well, I guess he has to because I, I supposedly he, he's like killed so many folks before. I mean, the, all of the subordinates have. So they're probably co really cocky and they're like thinking, yeah, how can this this router be any different or this person be any different but yeah we go down here and we did kind of see a, a ghost in the beginning of this part but I mean in the last episode what is that doing here oh Melissa what is your problem I mean this is not something to take lightly couldn't you couldn't have been locked in here it's holding a note. A message is scratched on the paper. How many days have passed since he locked me up in here? I can barely write anymore. I came in to rescue you, but now I too have been made a prisoner. I have broken my promise to protect you. Soon I will be unable to even record these feeble thoughts. I have lost the spectacles which you gave me. Is it too much to ask for any remnant of you in my last hours? And I really do feel for this guy. You, you know, it's you don't really get to know the person, but the little note there or the little message there it makes you feel for him. And you're not highly helping ghosts. You're just with your, you know, they sound like every other ghost. Did they really have to use that that noise for them? But yeah, here you go. You get your glasses, and you know I really feel for you, guy. I I uh, and you you actually give us something that's really useful. The only one, the only ghost that gives us something that we can't go on without a card key. 
But yeah. Totally going to go up. No, no. We want to go up to the up the ladder. Okay. Go on and climb it. <laughs> My goodness. I don't know if I would climb with that. I, I don't know. It's kind of dangerous. But yeah, whatever this thing is. Oh no. Leave me alone. Oh, you are just not my friend, that is for sure. Oh, but yes, let's uh, <laughs> make our way to uh, use the rubber gloves. <laughs> yeah, of course. Uh, let's calm ourselves first before he kills us. Yeah, no, 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 get, get, get going. Okay, um, uh, get up, get up. Oh my goodness, you better. You can't get away. Uh, I just. All right then. Yeah, let's just panic some more. This is the best day ever for you. Come on, come on, stop it. Get going. Get, get to that. You can't, get, get you can't do anything now, huh, man? <sighs> All right. <laughs> More lavender water. Yeah. That's what I get for waiting that long. Come here. Come here. Yeah, we've got things to do, so you just need to... Wait, come on. <laughs> Alyssa, stop derping around. Okay. So, uh, we do have the diagram or whatever you want to call it for this, but I believe it's just right to middle and then middle to left and then left to right there we go now we have to go up to that floor um if i can remember which yeah. one it is <laughs> yeah yeah there you go get get really into throwing your little axe oh, there nice trick. <laughs> i don't know why he thinks everything is a trick all right uh i think it was B1. Yeah, let's go to B1. I'm pretty sure that's it. We're at number one. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Does anyone not like riding elevators? I guess you do kind of get that weird feeling in the pit of your stomach, but it's not that bad. At least not for me. And I get car sickness, so uh, I, of course that's different. But, well, I don't know. I haven't been, gotten... I don't know, gotten pretty close recently, but it kind of sucks because it's not like I haven't been traveling in a car for all my life. But, well, you know, we go on family trips and stuff like that. But yeah, let's reuse up this lever. Yeah, it's working and then a door will work for us. So everything's coming together. We have our key card and then we don't have to deal with this chopper guy anymore. At least hopefully we don't because it's just so annoying. And we only have one more use of holy water. And it's like, he just keeps coming after us. He won't leave us alone. And it wouldn't be good for him to throw one at us right here. It certainly is more to his advantage than he's somehow right behind us. Yeah, yeah, let's use a car key. Come on, hurry up. Hurry up. My goodness, open the door, child! <laughs> I think it's not really that, like, much of a child, but yeah, I like, got this. Repellent arrow. Look at that. Yeah, we're just gonna save that as usual. And let's refill our holy water. Never bad time to be safer than sorry. Or whatever. Oh, uh... I don't know, should I save? Probably not. Nah, let's just get going. Let's go up these stairs. Uh, Chopper's not bothering us at the moment, so hey. Well, I'm happy about that because he just kept on bothering us the whole time. What the hell is that noise? A brand new toy rabbit? It can't be the one I was given when I was a child. Oh, well, that is very strange. Just, whoa. Whoa, what happened to the cardboard? It's not cardboard, the 2x4s or whatever you want. I don't know, whatever. Nothing of interest here. Alright. Um, sure, whatever. This is all very strange and, uh, I don't know, nothing, nothing seems right in this, in this house anymore. Can't get in, it's locked! Hmm, Nancy? 
Where's Mom's name doing there? Alright then. I wonder if you guys have already guessed what's going to happen right now. <laughs>